BT picking up the Champions League, which confirms that DAZN and Sky are not getting it. They were uh, the other two that were part of the bid. I think also Amazon was part of the bid in some fashion. I remember reading something about Amazon Prime or Amazon, some something yeah. about Amazon. And ITV. Which um, a lot of people wanted because that would be free TV. So, uh, yeah, $1.2 billion, uh, pounds, sorry, uh, $400 million a year. Uh, but, yeah, um, it, it, like I said, uh, when we disc- talked about this, it was a long shot that uh, DAZN would uh, – there was a chance maybe. But, uh, yeah, I think it was, I said at the time, like a very slim chance. But, uh, yeah, um, as DAZN didn't win it, it's no longer – applicable to talk about i guess <laughs> well we can talk about at least in some aspect like the zone because they are going to break into the uk market in 2021 that's what they've been saying for a while uh they don't have championship champions league now i don't know when premier league is up uh, i'm not sure I'm uh not sure. maybe look that up as i'm talking really fast if you can mm-hmm. uh and we know that matchroom is up in 2021 so we know that obviously zone's going to say hey eddie you're going to come over to us full-time now instead of Sky. And now Eddie fully is aware that they don't have Champions League. And again, I, I like to know what the Premier League is, uh, their situation is, and when they're up. But is this... I'm being negative. Oh, well. Is this a like a big shot? Not at, but a big shot to the zone before they even enter the UK market by not getting this deal in a way like does this hurt their overall chances to be a market leader so to speak in the uk rob are you frozen up or just you just highly Uh, still i think they're available oh great pop-up where the fuck that come from uh the last rights uh included three seasons of 2019 20 21 22 so it'll be 22 2022 to 23 would be available so yeah so the following year right 2022 um yeah. um rob like what do you think the zone's chances are are now in the in the uk i know that like, it's liked over there by uk fans obviously because the eddie hearn connection matchroom connection um, it's a UK based company as well. So like, you know, their spokespeople like Joe Makovsky are also British, so you have that familiarity in a way. Um yeah. is is this a big hindrance to the zone UK? Uh I think I mean look, I it, think they will have to get some like, in, in similar way to the US not getting the big deals. Yeah, right. yeah. Uh without any like major uh, football or slash soccer uh, rights. It, it, yeah, it's going to be a tough, tough draw. Um, yeah, I don't know. It'd be interesting because I think they will want to try and tap into this My very sporty nation. We do pretty much love most sports um, as a nation. So, um, yeah, but it would have to be, I think, like, an attempt to get in the Premier League or at least uh, the the Championship, which is the league below, or I don't know, even like the the FA Cup if they got round, you know, certain or, or things like that. So now, but it will be a tough ask to drag customers, you know, to spend whatever they decide the price point will be here, like whether it ties up with the twenty dollars. So what would that be like, fifteen pounds or? Or whatever. I don't know. But uh, yeah, it'd be difficult without some major sporting rights. Now, could they survive on, let's say, like cricket or, or rugby or, or and or rugby? Could they survive off of those other sports per se and not football? Uh, like is cricket, a, a, is there? Well, only really like a summer sport here. Okay. Um, I mean, there are international. Of course, yeah. Stuff going on. But and it's not you- the same as obviously British Premier League or Champions League, of course, but yeah, yeah. But what yeah, what, what what's the league. what's the cricket league in the UK like? What's it called? Ah, uh, it, it very uh, might be difficult to uh, really get across. But there's like basically like you guys, you got your states. Yes. Uh, I've got you. So we've got the counties. Yeah. 
so you got the county championship. Okay. That's a certain form of cricket. Then you got like there's there's different sorts, but now just do county champions like face off against each other? Uh yeah, you get the like the the winner of the county championship at the end of it, yeah. But they've never really had televised county championship matches on UK TV anyway. So, so I don't know. So, whether it would... so what's te- what's what, what are televised cricket games? Right, a lot of England and uh, and like then Commonwealth also, games more shorter shorter format games of cricket like can be done in a day rather than because county cricket is four day uh, match. So it's a bit of an ask during the week for people to be tuning on from uh, 10.30 in the morning till sort of 6 o'clock in the evening um, when the cricket matches are happening. People are at work and shit like that. You know, county championship cricket matches are poorly attended. Really. Chase, Chase Athletic saying maybe big money in the Indian Cricket League. I don't know. Uh, the IPL, yeah, that would be big. That's a big tournament. Very short format of the game. Exciting, you know, a uh, looking to hit the ball out the ground every time. Uh, yeah, so that that would be a bit more of a draw. I plus, there's a hu- plus there's a huge in, uh, Indian population in the UK, obviously. So yeah, 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 yeah. But again, is it a big subscription driver? I don't, I don't necessarily think. I mean, if DAZN India opened up and they got all the cricket rights in India, fuck yeah. That'd be huge, obviously, yeah. Shut down America, you're good. You don't need a uh, DAZN USA. <laughs> um, that would be kind of true, yeah. probably. Over here, it'd be tricky. I think if they could get a, a like what you want over there, you want um, more content, you want more sports, more more bang for your buck, as you keep saying, yes. for your design subscription. Yeah. It's, it is twenty dollars for matchroom shows, basically, um, and, and the occasional Bellator or World Boxing. Yeah, series, yeah, yeah. But, but that's yeah. about it. Um, and snooker. So here, if there was, like you say. Um, like snooker is quite a watch sport over here. Like if the snooker world championship that draws a big, uh, cause that's on free to air at the moment. So do people sign up for it? I don't know. I don't necessarily think people what well, suddenly I've got to pay to watch snooker when it was free on TV. Sure. Um, but if they got certain major events from certain sports and that was spread out through the year, it, it could be a, a subscription driver. But yeah, without without soccer... It's not enough to be the market leader, so to speak. Not really compete with the BT and the skies of the world. Uh, that, look, BT, they've um, they've got a certain amount of Premier... The, the Premier League matches here are spread out. You've got yeah. Summer on Sky, Summer on... I think Amazon gets some of them. Yes. And uh, BT have got uh, uh, Premier League matches as well. Uh, so yeah, that I don't know. You that would be tricky, but yeah, no Champions League. That's everything. Uh, basically, European team football is all on BT now, as of the the deal done today. So it can be a tough, tough market entrance. For yeah, it zone. will be. It will be. But um, yeah, we'll see. And but, it's interesting. I expected cricket to be more of a a factor in this discussion and it's not that's really shocking it seems like it's it's football or nothing in the uk as in really driving yes. big significant yes. amount of subscribers and that's if what we're talking get, about here if it came in does who the fuck is this does uk what's this oh that's where you're going to be watching the premier league this year then you're going to get fucking millions of people sign up straight away or uh, uh, and and the champions league fucking <laughs> sign yeah, me yeah. up but without those it'll be core little hardcore groups of whether that would accumulate into a decent subscription probably maybe but i'll say this i'll say this i'm maybe it's shocking but i think the zone has a much easier time in the u.s market than they have in the uk market right now with the way you you frame the discussion because it seems like it's football or nothing in the uk here at least like if you get fuck nhl (laughs) that's a niche market but that's still one of the big four like you can you can survive off of that, guaranteed. Yeah. Uh, if you get NBA, if you get MLB, if you get NFL, like you're safe. Hell, fucking NASCAR. Like there are some that you know you can sort of survive off of in a way in yeah. the U.S. market. Well, not being a market leader per se, but still drive subscribers, still be a successful business. I, it doesn't seem like that's the same way in the U.K. And that's kind of shocking. I thought again, cricket would be more of a factor. Uh, not gonna say it's it's uh. It's not so much it's football or nothing, and you you got no chance. But I don't think it would ha- they would have the impact that potentially they would look for. You know, you would say, correct me if I'm wrong, that there's no like 
clear big four in the same way as there is in the US. No, no. I mean, even your big four isn't there's there's a an there's, order. For that, yes, right? There is an order. Absolutely. And there's a vast from four to one. Well, no, I'll say this. It's like one, two, three, all neck and neck, and then like four is like the redheaded stepchild. Oh, NHL. That, that gets abused. Yeah. But saying that it's I so bad. People were like the thing about this. Oh, sorry. Becomes World Series. People aren't that mad into baseball, right? Or are they? No, no, no of course not. It's not the same. Top, obviously, right? like it obviously tops off with the World Series. Same with NFL, of course, and, and such. But um, yeah, people watch. Yes, NFL and, and, and it's like, less games. It's more concentrated. It's more concentrated. So therefore, you can get higher viewerships and you know more well liked. Uh, obviously, Gary's brought up college football, and they should be going. They should be going after college football. I've been saying that for a while. Even just like individual uh, universities. Like there is a cottage industry of these big in- universities that you can tap into yeah. uh, if you're to zone. Um, I wonder if Oxford University could do but, it. <laughs> but I'll say this: uh, NHL is so bad that the entire like ESPN fired their entire NHL staff like a year or two ago because it was like we never talk about this shit. We're just gonna fire everyone. Yeah, but, yeah. They fired like four hundred or three hundred people, and like the entire NHL staff wow. on espn was included uh yeah so again there there's avenues of more success i think for the zone than there is in the uk i'm shocked by that because you guys in the uk want this thing so bad it's, it's clear that you guys I, love it you boxing fans are diehards for the zone you don't even have it sad man I'm, for a lot of people i mean i sent it you in our group chat right because we're going to get on to uh uh potentially the Sky box office for Joshua Rees, right? Yeah. Which is twenty four ninety nine, which is a yeah, increase. it's basically five pounds more yeah. than we've ever really had to pay. Which yeah, it doesn't sound a lot, but when you look at what my monthly uh, Sky bill is, Sky bill's insane. Oh, I don't know why Sky costs that much, dude. The entire your entire Sky package is more than my entire cable package, and then including like Showtime. <laughs> that's just yeah that's not even including my uh cable package but that's my like i mean my uh my like broadband my internet yeah. or whatever yeah well not my internet my, my internet bill is different than my cable bill but well, sky is basically cable right yeah like like sky is not your internet provider right uh well they they are as well i think is it a separate bill or is it bill also in, included no, with that I, I can send you what that is as well Send me what that is. I'm curious. I am curious. Uh, but it is separate. Okay, it is separate. I'm just curious about that. If it was tabulated with your cable I, bill I, I separated it to show you what Sky TV. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah. All right. But um, digressing. Um, uh, my cable bill is like 65 bucks on PlayStation View. I get like everything I need. And then like obviously Showtime and HBO I get on the side. Um, that's another like 20 bucks combined, something like that. Digressing though. Um Moving on. 